What's up guys, Art Statue Collector here and today we are going to check out XM Studios 1.4 scale cable with Hope. So let's go check it out. Cable is a time-traveling soldier and the original leader of X-Force team. He is the son of Cyclops and a clone of Jean Grey. He has limitless telepathic power and always armed. Let's check out the dimension. He is about 50 cm in height, 38 cm in length, and 36 cm in depth. He weighs about 8 kg. The edition size is $999. Pre-order price is about $1,250. It came in one box that weighs about 23 kilograms. Artists involved for this project are Rafa Sandoval, Paul Tan, and XM Studios design team. Let's look at the details. The base is the same theme as Apocalypse and Angel. It has the same Egyptian base with tentacle wrap around and cable standing on wreck mechanical of some sort. He has on a classic blue and yellow X-Men costume with belt full of ammunition. His right arm is holding a big gun while his left is holding hope. He is wearing a poncho over his costume with rifle strapped to the back. It came with three different portraits include bearded, straight face, and angry face. Two switch out left arm where one is holding hope and the other one is holding a big gun. Alright, so I don't really collect X-Men line, but I do like the X-Force line. And a lot of people seem to like the OG Cable better or the other one from another company. But I can't really say a lot because I have never seen them in hand. But what I can say is this statue looks pretty good. It has great details and most of the paint application is very nice. Alright, let's start with the base. It has the same theme as the other X-Force series. Overall, it looks pretty good. Other than this teal strip right here, I don't know what they are supposed to be, but it just looks out of place. I think cable here looks great. I don't have anything bad to say here, other than the switch out portrait. However, they did a great job of sculpting the hair and face. Color is well painted too. 
I love this bearded portrait and it's the one I prefer. This one, not at all. I think the eyes on the right here are just way too small, which make him look kind of weird. The grinded portrait is okay, but still doesn't really do it for me. But I'm just glad that they gave us three all together. The pawn show here looks really good though, and it's something different. Plus, you can take it off like so as an option, and you can show off his bag with this piece. The vein on his right arm here is pretty ridiculous, but it looks great. Maybe tune down on the yellow color a bit. I love his metal arm. It's shiny and it looks really badass. This may be the best feature of the statue. All of the guns have nice weight to it. They don't look or feel cheap at all. Great details again here. On the other hand, Hope gives a good story to the statue, but she looks like a doll. Not just her face, but her arm as well. All right, I think overall this cable is a solid piece, but it's all up to a person's taste. If you are like the one you already have in your collection, there's no need for you to buy this piece. Unless you are looking for a new cable, something more different, then this might be it for you. All right, thank you for watching and see you on the next review. Peace.